Hello everybody, welcome back to Travel Vida. Today we're embarking on an extraordinary journey deep into the heart of the Amazon rainforest, Iquitos, Peru. This enchanting destination, often referred to as the capital of the Peruvian Amazon, boasts a rich tapestry of history, culture, and natural wonders. Nestled within a dense jungle foliage, Iquitos stands as one of the world's largest inaccessible cities, accessible only by boat or air. Join me and my wonderful wife Leslie as we dwell into the marvels of Quistococha Touristic Park where we'll encounter some of the Amazon's most captivating creatures up close. Then immerse yourself in the vibrant pulse of Iquitos in their nightlife as we explore the city's energetic atmosphere together. And to cap off our adventure, indulge in a delectable meal at a one-of-a-kind floating restaurant perched atop the mighty Amazon River itself. So fasten your seatbelts and prepare for an unforgettable expedition through the heart of the Amazon with Leslie and myself. My adventure commenced at the bustling Iquitos main square, where we were greeted by the breathtaking view of this verdant paradise. The lush greenery, vibrant colors, and bustling atmosphere immediately immersed us in rich culture and natural beauty of the Amazon. Eager to dive deeper into the local experience, we seized the opportunity to indulge in a quick meal, savoring the delicious flavors of the region's cuisine. Following my energizing meal, I embarked on a scenic 30-minute journey from the heart of Iquitos to the Amazon Rescue Center. Here I found a ton of exotic species native to the Amazon rainforest. Venturing deeper into the sanctuary, I was captivated by the sight of a mighty jaguar, also known as the Atorongo. Forgive me if I mispronounce that. It's the most powerful feline in America, measuring up to almost six feet or 1.8 meters and weighing over 285 pounds or 130 kilos. Iquitos is known for being a region with heavy rains and I was able to experience this firsthand. I am soaking Once the rain stopped, we continued our journey navigating through the lush vegetation in search of the elusive tapir, known for their distinctive long nose and gentle demeanor. As I strolled around, I couldn't help but notice a small monkey trailing me along the fence line for nearly 20 minutes. To my surprise, it even leaped onto my shoulder, seeking my attention. Initially, I assumed it was just hungry, so I offered it some crackers that I had on hand. However, to my amusement, the monkey showed no interest in the food. It quickly became clear that the true desire was simply for companionship and interaction. Before I forget, let me share with you an unforgettable culinary experience tasting the most delicious fish that I've ever had the pleasure of savoring, the paiche. One of the largest species of fish in the Amazon River, measuring up to 10 feet or three meters long and 550 pounds or 250 kilos. Absolutely my favorite fish. As dust descended upon us on the rainforest, I said goodbye to the Amazon Rescue Center and made our way back to the Iquitos Main Square. However, my adventure was far from over as the vibrant nightlife of the city beckoned us to explore its lively streets and bustling bars. I want to take a quick second to thank our sponsor, Cruiser Travels. Cruiser Travels makes trips like this possible with discounted group rates, exclusive perks, only provided by Cruiser Travels, knowledgeable and service-focused agents committed to sourcing the best deals in the industry. They won't be beat. Tell them Travel Vita sent you for an extra gift. The link is in the description below. The next morning, we headed to the dock to boat along the Amazon River for our next destination. 
But not before finding the rural markets in the port, what caught our attention were the Surrey. It is a plump larva worm between five and seven centimeters long. In Iquitos, it's common to eat Surrey and other annelids seasoned and served on a skewer. I tried eating the worm and I found it to be a bit too gooey in the middle to enjoy it, but I had to try it. Zarpamos en un pequepeque desde el puerto de Nanay hacia el Serpentario de Iquitos, un santuario natural donde se crían serpientes de diferentes tipos y tamaños. En el interior de este centro de rescate peruano, tuvimos la posibilidad de conocer otros animales curiosos y exóticos. If you're enjoying this video, I greatly appreciate it if you could take a moment to like, subscribe, and leave a comment sharing your favorite part of the adventure. Your feedback means the world to me and helps me create content that resonates with you. Thank you for your support. Los monos nos regalaron momentos divertidos, pero sin duda alguna, este adorable oso perezoso se robó todo mi corazón. Su mirada serena y su pelaje suave me recordaron la importancia de la calma y la armonía en la naturaleza. <risa> Tenemos ahí más, eh, si quiere tomarse una bonita fotito cargando. Llegó el momento cumbre de nuestra visita, la oportunidad de tener un encuentro cercano con una de las serpientes más grandes del mundo, la anaconda. Esta especie llega a medir hasta 10 metros de longitud y tiene la capacidad de cazar y consumir animales de gran tamaño, como tapires, ciervos o cuatís. Definitivamente, la anaconda nos recuerda la fuerza y el poder que habitan en la selva amazónica. El gusto de ti. Ya, ya, ya te va a gustar a la anaconda. Video ahora. Agárrale acá. No, 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 no,
Finally, we arrived at El Frio y El Fuego, the only floating restaurant in the Peruvian Amazon. Grilled dishes, cocktails, and desserts all made with fresh, locally sourced ingredients from the Amazon rainforest and river. The view was amazing and they even had a pool and loungers for those that wanted to soak up some sun and get some pool time in. And that concludes today's video, brimming with encounters with exotic animals from the Peruvian Amazon, immersive nightlife experiences in Iquitos, breathtaking landscapes, boat trips, and dining at a floating restaurant nestled into the heart of the Amazon. I trust you've enjoyed this captivating journey. Next week, we'll embark on another thrilling adventure to Area 15 in Las Vegas, a burgeoning hub of art installations and immersive experiences. Join us as we explore the innovative wonders of the Asylum Bar, Wink World, Illuminarium, Omega Mart, and much more. Stay tuned for an unforgettable exploration of creativity and innovation. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and until next time, 